Let me tell you a story. Once upon a time in this country, kids worked in factories, and women weren't allowed to vote. So people decided to speak out. They left homes and hit the streets. The kids held banners over their heads, so high into the sky. With Mother Jones, the little steps linked Philly to NYC, saying that our future awaits. And the women wore beautiful hats to parades. Their audience covered the street like a new carpet, rolled out all the way to the Capitol. And there was a time when working 80 hours was commonplace. So people began to sing. We are summoning our forces from shipyard, shop, and mill. Eight hours for work, eight hours for rest, eight hours for what you will. At times, the sound of the singing tangled with the sound of mourning. At Haymarket in Chicago, fear and gunpowder blackened the square. But we had to get back on our feet, because more changes must be made. Our dream was yet to be heard by history. Our silent sit-in was yet to be witnessed by history. So when our young sons were drafted into the army and sent to Vietnam, we knew more changes must be made. And when today a full-time worker still struggles for rent, more changes must be made. My dear boy, today you ask me why must we vote? I hope now you have understood. Wow, 